Hey, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. Okay, you guys, I've got 46 big money bolos coming your way. Um, these items are from my featured members of my Bolo Buddies YouTube channel. What that means is these members have joined Bolo Buddies memberships for perks. So basically, I am going to share their bolos, advertise their channel, and also their channels and their eBay stores will be linked down in the description of the video. So, um, I also do a bonus video that I feature on my other channel, Sourcing with Bolo Buddies. Let me show you that real quick. And let's see. Here it is, Sourcing with Bolo Buddies. I just hit 2K subscribers over there. Thank you for everyone that has subscribed. This is a newer channel. Um, the featured members bonus video, they are over here and they are getting way less views because I have way less subs. And I'm guessing that most of you don't know that it's taking place. So come on over, subscribe, hit that bell so you get notifications when I post new videos. And basically the bonus video is just a shorter version of this video I'm about to do. Now, if you would like to become a Bolo Buddies member, you can join by clicking the join button. If you're at your computer or laptop, you can usually see a join button. It's right here. This is last month's vid video. 41 Big Money Bolos featured members share eBay Bolo items. Be on the lookout. And this is just one of the amazing Bolo items that sold. So these videos are packed with info from a bunch of different resellers who have reseller channels who are Bolo finders. Um, if you cannot find the join button, you can go down to the description and it will say join this channel to get access to perks. You can click on that. And just below that, you're going to find every channel's channel and their eBay store. So please go subscribe to these channels. They have fantastic reseller content. They all bring something different to their channels. And I think you guys will learn a lot. So um, are you guys ready to dig in to some big money bolos? Um, I hope you guys will join memberships. If you join at the $4.99 level, you will get featured in this video once a month. I also do some other things, usually some type of bonus every month. Um, like right now I've been doing Facebook. Um, I do a Facebook share post and then I create a video out of that. And if you're a member of my channel, I go ahead and shout you out in that video also. So um, lots of stuff going on. I'm doing a, this is my bolo for featured members this month where they come on and they do a 60 second clip and I create a video with it. Super fun, one of my favorite videos. So that may have already posted. You'll have to check. If not, it'll be coming soon. All right, you guys, let's dig into these 46 bolos. Um, how this works is I'm going to tell you where they got it, what they paid for it, and what it sold for. And I'm also going to introduce their channel to you if they have a channel. And then we are going to have a speed round at the end. So 23 and then 23 in the speed round. So are you guys ready to learn? So put on your listening caps and let's get started. Okay. Are you ready? I don't know why I did that. I didn't mean to do that. Let's go back here. Okay. So the first bolo comes and I, I just had to redo this video because I messed something up. So I want to make sure that my screen shares up. Okay. The first one comes from the funky pickle thrifter and she is really amazing with jewelry. She does sell other stuff also, but definitely check out her channel if you want to learn more about jewelry. Um, and wait until you see her bolo. You guys are going to be like, wow. Okay. So this is a rare crown trafari. It's a, uh, rhinestone brooch, you guys. And she talks about this more on the, this is my bolo, um, video collab that I'm doing. And she explains it much better than me. So I'm going to leave that to her. I'm just going to tell you that she got this at a pawn shop. It sold within 15 minutes on eBay for $999.99. And I would think it was a dollar. So amazing. The next item comes from Nikki Love Snacks. And she's got some reseller content over on her channel. She's growing her channel right now. She puts some different things on there. So um, it's not all reseller content, but definitely go check her out. Um, she sold these golf clubs. They are tailor-made. And I know that I've been seeing a lot of resellers selling golf clubs. It's kind of one of those things that I stay far away from. But after seeing this sold, I'm like, hmm, maybe I should be looking at golf clubs. These tailor-made M2 irons sold for $490, you guys. 
Um, these were actually a personal item from her house and they were her husband's. So don't be afraid to sell items from your home. You just may have a bolo sitting around. The next item came from farm girl scavenger Noel. Um, and Noel is a major bolo finder with so much knowledge about so many things. Um, does money grow on trees? You got to check out that video and see how she basically sources from her yard. Um, it's amazing. Um, she also does these let's talk videos, which are kind of like my bolo category videos where I pick a category and I kind of do a deep dive. Hers is totally different though. She does a live show format, but she digs into certain categories like I do. So if you guys like those videos, definitely go check out her let's talk. Um, Let's see, Noelle, what did she sell? She is a bolo finder, I'm telling you guys. Okay, so I have sold these before. Um, they are vintage Bucilla um, felt holiday ornaments. So people buy kits and they make these. So they are handmade ornaments. You guys, it's unbelievable, but these sell for a lot of money. Um, I sold the Wizard of Oz set and I think I sold a nursery rhyme set. This is the Nutcracker set of four. And she got this at an estate sale and a bag full for $5. So this sold for a best offer of $75. The next item comes from The Thrifty Nurse. And she has tons of reseller content. She sells a lot on Mercari. So she's very knowledgeable about Mercari. But check out some of her videos. Um, she's also on Facebook Marketplace. But she she's a bolo finder. She has some really great stuff. And she's got what solds and sourcing videos. So definitely show her some love with a sub. That is Thrifty Nurse. And Thrifty Nurse sold this Department 56 McDonald's uh, lot. And I'm seeing here that she got it at an estate sale for $3. But I'm wondering if that was $30. Because $3 would be an amazing price for something this cool. Um, it sold for $199 and the buyer paid shipping and hopefully she'll watch this and let me know in the comments if I had a typo or if she really got it for $3. But either way, definitely a bolo. The next item comes from Yard Sales and Dreams and she has an amazing YouTube channel. Also, you guys definitely go down and check out these channels. She picked up this amazing clock at an estate sale. And I got to tell you, if I would have found this between my husband and I, um, he loves clocks, and I think this is really cool. This may have been a hashtag keeper. Um, and actually, Danielle did a video on items that she's kept, which was a really cool video. You can check that out on her channel. But she got this at an estate sale for $30, and it sold for $225. It's a mid-century modern Robert Shaw atomic wall clock. And it looks like it may have been on Everybody Loves Raymond on the show. So pretty cool. The next item comes from Money Making Mama, and she has a gift for finding items and lotting them up. So she retail arbitrages at like pallet places and stuff like that. Uh, there's a place she goes to called Dirt Cheap, and she is pretty fantastic at this. And if you guys have been watching my featured members videos, you've seen her do it before. But this time, she bought these Febreze, their one fabric air mist refills for... Um, $3 each at dirt cheap. So she got 28 of them. So she's got about $90 with tax and everything in them. And she flipped them for $249.99 free shipping. The next item comes from auctions for you. And she buys storage units and she buys out thrift stores. She, she buys in bulk. Let's just say that. And then she offers it to people that come to her auctions and selling events on her YouTube channel for a really good price. And I have purchased a lot of items that I have flipped for great profits. And I have actual videos where I share with you guys those unboxings and how I listed the items. But Auctions for You recently found a storage unit full of toys. And this is a crossbows and catapults game from 1983, still sealed. And she sold this for $399 plus shipping. And it came out of a storage unit. The next item comes from the Thrifty Broad. And she took a YouTube break and she changed her name. And she is back and going strong with some what sold videos. She sells on Mercari, Poshmark, and eBay. And if you want to see what she is um, selling, definitely go check her out. 
and she sold this flannel shirt. It is 316 is the brand. I've never heard of it. This is what the tag looks like. She sold this for a best offer of $120, you guys. She picked it up at the Goodwill Benz outlet for $2. The next item comes from Franklin Hill Ventures. He um, specializes in booths. He has antique booths and vintage with vintage items. And he also sells on multiple platforms. So you can check out his channel for more information on that. He picked up these set of two clay city potty, city potty, city pottery nesting mixing bowls. And he sold them on Mercari for $75. This is what the bottom looks like. And the buyer did pay shipping on that. This was a consignment deal. So I believe it was a 50-50 split. The next item comes from a little bluebird. She's got a little bit of content on her channel, but not much. But you can definitely go down below and look up her eBay store. She sold this monkey pod mid-century modern wood anthere anthurium flower handcrafted. And you guys look, it breaks apart. It's like a puzzle. How cool is that? She got this at a thrift store for $1 and sold it for a best offer of $95. The next item is from Toledo Antique. And they just got back from vacation. So they've got some uh, vacation videos here at the top. So if you just scroll past them, you'll get down into some of their live sales and their reseller content. They do have a video where they show, I'm going to try to get down here to it, how to pack fine china. And this is a huge set of china, as you can see right there. And in this video, they show you how they pack it up. So if you're interested in that, definitely check it out. This is a set that I featured on last month's video, and I told you that it sold for $5,200, and I think it sold for $5,500, so I wanted to showcase this again. Um, talk about a shipping nightmare, you guys. I believe they ship all of their items on their own, so I am guessing that this probably has arrived at its destination by now. So my question to you, Toledo Antique, if you are watching, did this fine china set make it safely. Uh, they picked this up at an estate sale for $2, or not $2, $2,000, and sold it for $5,500 on eBay. The next item comes from Philly Flipper, and he picked up this item at a garage sale for $0.50. Cents. It sold in less than two minutes for big money, and I'm going to show it to you in a minute. But first, I want to tell you about his channel. He has a ton of yard sale videos and his yard sale videos are really unique. He has really cool editing things that he does on his videos. And um, he also pops up screenshots of how he listed things and tells you what has sold. So it's, you're getting an education when you watch his videos. Okay, so this is what he sold. It's a Wall Street VHS, Michael Douglas, Charlie Sheen VHS, still sealed, sold for $250, you guys. Got it for 50 cents at a yard sale and sold in less than two minutes. The next item is from Neat Finds from Naomi. And she has an amazing eBay store. So definitely go check her out. The link is down below. And she sold this paperweight. She picked this paperweight up at an auction. And I think it was in a lot of items. So her cost of goods was about $2.47. And I'm trying to find, here it is. Um, right here. Uh, she sold this for a best offer of $100. The next item came from Horse and Hair Curiosity Shop. Here are some of the items in her eBay store. She also has an amazing store with unique and unusual items. That is for sure. I, I just can't believe the things she finds. It's amazing. Her whole store is just awesome. Okay, she sold this turkey. And it is a Willie Ray Thanksgiving Turkey, Mr. Turkey from 2006. She got it at the Goodwill for $6.60 and took um, and sold it for $98. This is what the bottom looks like, you guys. I can't say I would have known to pick this up. <laughs> I mean, it seems pretty just normal. Uh, but yeah, $98 on that one. The next item sold from Jack's Treasures. And they do a lot of storage units and they have other content on their channel. So definitely go check them out. But if you're into storage units, this would be a great channel to subscribe to. They picked up this Kiss Collection watch in a tin. Um, they picked up $50 box at a garage sale. It was just stuffed full of Kiss band collector items. And they had approximately 12, or I'm sorry, approximately $2 in this. 
and it sold for $96 plus shipping. The next item comes from Chosen Goods Reseller. She has a new live show every Thursday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And also go check out her This Is My Bolo Challenge winnings. She won the Bolo This Is My Bolo Challenge that I put on on my channel. And everybody that lost had to send her a gift. So she is currently unboxing those and sharing the videos. This video is awesome. She got some amazing stuff. So I highly recommend you go check it out. This is her Bolo. It's a Fisher Price movie viewer, and she actually got this in a mystery box from Auctions for You, who I mentioned earlier. And she divided out the number of items by what she paid for the box and had about 65 cents in this. And it sold for $22.06 plus shipping. The next item comes from Anytime Picker, and he picked up this remote, and it is a smart TV remote. He got it at the Goodwill for $1 and sold it for $99. So definitely go over to his channel, Anytime Picker, to see more Bolo solds. The next item comes from Sister Rescued Treasures, and they are on Mercari and eBay. And they picked up this Scream mask at a Goodwill for $2.98, and it sold for $90 on Mercari. So I was snooping around their store. I can't remember if it was eBay or Mercari. Um, it was for one of my videos and I saw this screen mask and they had it underpriced. And I was like, hey, I just want you to know I just sold one of these masks for, I think mine sold for 90 also. I sold mine on eBay, but I was like, I think you can get more for your mask. So they upped the price and it sold really fast and it sold for $90. So I was really happy that I could help them. Um, I have actually undersold a screen mask in the past, so um, it does happen. And I just happened to have just sold this exact one, so I knew what it was valued at. So super exciting. The next item comes from Be Carried Away, and this is a really cool bolo. She is a bolo finder. She specializes in vintage clothing and vintage items. She has fantastic key words. Go check her out. This is a vintage pair of paint by number pictures. They're swans and they were framed really well done, but she got these at the um, Salvation Army for $4.99 for the pair and sold them in a few hours for $89.25 plus shipping. The next item comes from Butterfly Hustles who recently hit 1K subscribers. If you guys aren't subscribed, head on over and give her a sub. She gets tons of bolos from Ballot value village um, and she's got videos to prove it so go check that out she picked up this vintage rare looney tunes characters thick blanket and she got this at the goodwill for five dollars and 49 cents and took a best offer of 87 dollars and 49 cents tell me guys would you have known that this was worth that much i don't think i would have the next item comes from donatella bottolino who also does YouTube selling events. Um, her and T Auctions for You actually work together and they go on each other's channels. They go back and forth. But Donna Bottolino has also been trying to get some um, reseller content on her channel also. So she will show you hauls. And most recently, she's been dumpster diving. And the dumpster diving videos are so fun. You guys have got to go and check them out. Um, she go, she takes her daughters with her and they're really fantastic videos. So check those out. Um, and she's found some really great stuff. She actually found something, um, and she put it on eBay and flipped it super fast. So I hope to share that in next month's featured members video. Um, I, she's like, I just sold this. It was in the dumpster. And I'm like, no way. Um, and you guys, in the dumpsters, they put stuff in plastic bags. So it's not like it's just sprawled out in the dumpster. So check out that video and you'll see what I mean. But Donna is also a bolo finder, but most of her bolos are sold at her auctions in bulk to resellers who resell them for big money. But this guy, she hung on to and listed herself so that she could be featured in this video. And it is this Rosalie Frischman artist signed dog from 2002 you guys and when i say artist signed the paw is literally artist signed this thing is adorable look at it oh my goodness it's so cute it looks so real um and i'm guessing that's what this artist does is maybe she takes people's dogs and and makes them because it's amazing but it sold for 500 dollars, you guys and it sold 
really fast. I can't remember how fast, but really fast. And it's super cute. So the next idol com item comes from Mindful Recycle, who um, has kind of been taking a YouTube break, but I'm happy to say she just released a new video. It's not showing here because I didn't update my um, page before I started. It, uh, she just released it a couple days ago. So definitely go check out that what sold for tons of bolos. And I'm going to talk to you about this. And she said, I think I made a mistake, but I was just done with it. So she picked up this huge lot of Barbie items at a garage sale from a collector for $350. She ended up like putting all these bags of clothes. She separated everything, you guys. And then decided that she didn't want to list things individually. And she just put it in one big lot. Um, it sold for $800. But if she would have parted these things out, she could have made, oh my gosh, so much money. Some of these individual little accessories can go for $10, $15 just by themselves. But I will tell you, if you don't know Barbie stuff, this is overwhelming. Um, but if you're a Barbie collector and no Barbie stuff, this is like a dream come true. Um, so yeah, she flipped it 350 into 800 and she will do that a lot. She'll buy things in bulk and just bulks. She sells them out in bulk. The next item comes from the rebel reseller and she is about to hit one K. This has not been upgraded, upgraded, updated. Um, I bet she, she may have already hit it. So if not, if so, either way, go sub to her. You guys are going to love her content. And I am just shocked at the amount of views she's getting for being under a, um, 1K subscribers. I mean, this video has almost a thousand views. Her view, she's getting great views on her videos. And I know why, because they're fantastic. But I'm just not sure why she doesn't have more subscribers because she definitely deserves them. So definitely go and check out her channel. She's amazing. She has just fantastic finds. Um, whenever I watch her videos, I'm always like, I learn something new every time. Same with Mindful Recycle. So many of the channels that I watch, I just am always learning. Um, that's one benefit of having members is that I'm learning about all these new channels and I'm watching them and I'm learning. So I hope you guys also learn a lot from them. So she picked up this um, Opel glass ornament. It's a snowflake. I've never heard of this brand. This is what it looks like. It originally retailed for $4.40. She got this at an estate sale or a garage sale uh, for six, nine of them for $6. And this sold for $100. All right, you guys, are you ready for the speed round? Here we go. I'm going to give you 23 bolos from these same resellers, but we're going to do it fast. Okay. The first item comes from the Rebel reseller. It is a Mattel Tippy Toes doll. She got this at an estate sale for $5 and sold it for $165 best offer plus shipping. The next item comes from Mindful Recycle. It is a Linux complete set of Christmas carousel animal ornaments. There's 24 here. It's an amazing set. You guys, she picked this up for 65 and she sold it for $399 plus shipping. And that came from an estate sale. These Chanel black mules came um, from a bulk buy. Donatella Bottolino picked these up. And again, she knew they would be a quick flip. And she sold these for $400 free shipping. The next item comes from Butterfly Hustles. She got this at the Goodwill for $7.49 and took a best offer of $165.37. So this is a modernist green art glass vase, um, art deco, hand-blown white rim. And I don't think it's marked anywhere if I remember correctly. So definitely a very cool find. The next item sold from Be Carried Away. It is a JFK uh, statue sculpture bust and it is mid-century modern. She got it at the Salvation Army for $3.99 and it sold for $79.99 plus shipping. The next item was sold by Sister Rescued Treasures. It's um, a World War II game. It's a strategy game. It's from 2012 and it looks to be new. And she got it for 95 cents at the Goodwill and sold it for $38.59 plus shipping. The next item is this Thumper Mini Pro 
two percussive handheld massage ugh, massager. I can't talk with three speeds. So you guys, massagers, vintage massagers, discontinued massagers, they sell very well. Uh, definitely be on the lookout. This one came from Anytime Picker. He got it at the Goodwill for $10.29, and it sold for $79 plus shipping. The next item is from Chosen Goods Reseller. She got this out of a uh, subscription box that she buys, and she keeps what she wants, and she sells the items that she does not want. She paid... Um, Approximately $3.50 for these, and they sold for $50. It is the Salsa and Guac um, Ray Dunn set. And it looks like it comes with the spoons, which is kind of cool. And this is brand new. The next item comes from Jack's Treasures. This is a jacket that they got out of a storage unit. It's a Reebok jacket, and it says above the rim on the back. They got it out of a storage unit for $1, sold it for $79.99 plus shipping. The next item comes from Horse and Hair Curiosity Shop. It is a vintage Turkey Creek Pilgrim riding on a turkey, Robin Kelso, 2007. Again, I probably would have looked at the bottom of this and I don't know. You know, it does say dim, dim do, uh, I can never say this word. Dim Dotico, Dim Dotico, Dim Dotico, I think is how you say it. You know what? I remember now, I think I sold one of these Turkey Creeks and it was a bolo. Yes, I think I did. And mine was even broken, but it sold really quick. And I remember thinking, oh my goodness, because this is, um, I think Willow Tree says Dim Dotico on the bottom also. I may be saying that totally wrong, but we'll just pretend like I'm saying it right. But um, yeah, I guess be on the lookout for Robin Kelso. Uh, this sold for $155, picked it up at the Goodwill for $6.60. The next item comes from Naomi's, uh, or Neat Finds from Naomi, and it is a blanket. And she got this at the Salvation Army for $1.95, and it sold for $83.99. It is a vintage Bob Timberlake tapestry throw blanket, Old Salem, North Carolina houses. So I don't know about you guys, but this is something that I would walk right by. I would not even look at it. I would not comp it. I wouldn't, I, I just wouldn't. So um, definitely learn something there. All right, Philly Flipper picked this tractor up at the Goodwill bins. He's got about $13 in it and he sold this for $200 on auction. It's a vintage John Deere 1939 Model B tractor signed by Joseph Ertel. And it's missing the seat. The next item is from Toledo Antique. They picked up this duck decoy at an estate sale for $80. And they flipped it for $239.99. It is hand-carved, hand-painted duck decoy by Jass. J-A-S-S. -S. The next item is this Educa puzzle. It's a thousand-piece puzzle. Victoria Francis, Queen of the Outlaws. It's new and sealed. And a little bluebird picked this up at the Goodwill for $1.99 and sold it for $89 plus shipping. All right, the next item here comes from, sorry, Franklin Hills uh, Venture. Franklin Hill Ventures, sorry. It is a Royal Warwick uh, coffee pot, you guys. And I want to show you the bottom, maybe right here. And he got this at a, an estate sale for nine bucks and he sold it best offer for $40. The next item that sold is this Adriana Papel women's plus size 20W cocktail homecoming dress. This was picked up by Melissa, the thrifty broad at the bins for $2 and she took a best offer of 60. The next item is this Disney frozen sing-along Elsa. This came from auctions for you. She picked it up in a storage unit and it sold for $89.99 plus shipping and it was a new old stock item. This item, this Marvel Legends Alpha Flight Action Figure 5-pack set came from a pallet store. She paid $5 for it, you guys. This is Money Making Mama and I told you guys she likes those pallet stores and she cleans up. Sold it for $89.99 plus shipping. The next item comes from Danielle Yard Sales and Dreams. And this Mr. Potato Head, she has a video on her YouTube channel. Please go check it out. Um, you will be glad you did. It's a cool video. 
Uh, she got this for $17 at a thrift store and sold it for $120. The next item comes from Thrifty Nurse. It's a Lee Max Village. It's the Reptile House, which is pretty cool. Check that out. And it is, um, it lights up. And she got it at a thrift store for $7.50 and sold it for $145 plus shipping. The next item is this new with tags Build-A-Bear Jack-O-Lantern Pumpkin Fun Kitty. Noelle um, from Farm Girl Scavenger Noelle YouTube channel picked this up at an estate sale for $2. She researched it, found out that somebody on TikTok had recently done a viral video and everybody was looking for these kitty cats because of this video. And she sold this super fast for $349.99. The next item comes from Nikki Loves Snacks. Nikki, Nikki Love Snacks. And she got a whole bunch of stickers, a full box for $5 at a charity shop. And she sold 110 of them for $300. And I guess there were a bunch more that she sold also. I think she said she's made over $2,000 off of these stickers, you guys. Um, if you haven't seen my Bolo stickers category video, definitely go check it out. The next item that sold is from the Funky Pickle Thrifter. I think I said it in the right order. And she sold these five yards of fabric from the 1960s. You guys, it has the original tag on it right here. And she used the words Mod Curtains Pillows Psychedelic Hippie Flower Power 60s, 70s. And she got this at a yard sale for $1 and sold it for $129.99. All right, you guys, that concludes the video. Thank you so much for being here. If you would like to join memberships, again, you can hit that join button or go down to the description of the video and it'll say join this channel for perks. All of the YouTube channels that were featured in this video are posted down in the description of the video. If they have YouTube channel will be there, their eBay stores will also be linked. So take a minute, go down and check some of these guys out. They are amazing. Um, sourcing with Bolo Buddies, head over there to check out the featured seller or the featured members videos that you guys have missed because I know by the views that a lot of you have not come over and watched those. And it's probably because you don't know they're there. So definitely go and check them out. All right, you guys, I appreciate you all so much. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And leave me a hat emoji down in the comments if you made it this far. Thanks for watching.